our Rally for Vets program is uh, it has a couple of dimensions. Um, one of the dimensions, of course, is on-track racing. And we just finished our third year um, event at Summit Point Raceway, which is just outside of Washington, D.C. And this is a, an amateur race, and it's a, a, an event that anyone can drive in. You don't have to be a licensed uh, driver. Uh, if you had a race car, you could bring it, but most of our uh, participants bring their daily drivers. And um, so this is, it's a way to get a feel for what it's like to drive on a, on a racetrack in a very safe and controlled manner. So for the participants, it's the opportunity to, to drive in that kind of an event. Uh, but because this is focused on helping veterans and active duty uh, suicide prevention, you know, we have created something that's unique and that is that <clears throat> our event, which we call the Top Dog Championships, it's the only inner service motorsports competition in the world. And by that, you know, I mean that uh, the drivers uh, fall into teams. So if you're a, an active duty or a, an Army veteran, you're going to be driving for the Army team. And the same for the Navy and the Air Force. So think about the annual Army-Navy football rivalry, but played out on a racetrack with all of the services competing. And as a note, we actually had two Space Force drivers with us in October. <clears throat> um, so, so the benefit for the drivers is, you know, number one, a great day, uh, fun in a safe environment, and, uh, you know, the ability to compete with uh, their fellow servicemen a little, you know, smack, so to speak. And uh, the winning service team has their name inscribed on this trophy. And um, our next step is to present this trophy to the service chief of the winning service team, and they'll hold this trophy for a year until our next event. Now, uh, the funds that we generate from the event go to our service dog program. Um, we're working with another charity called Veterans Moving Forward, and Veterans Moving Forward trains service dogs um, that they provide to service uh, disabled veterans cost-free. And uh, our dog that's in training right now is named Woody. He's six months into his two-year training program. And we uh, so far have raised and donated $15,000 out of his $40,000 um, training cost. So for the veterans and active duty mil military guys, it's a great day on a great track for the charity it's uh, an opportunity to raise money and help a disabled veteran. Um, so that's what it's all about. It's, uh, you know, it's fun and uh, we would encourage anybody that's uh, interested in coming out and having a day at the track, even if you've never driven uh, what we call a high performance driving day, you can come out, make a donation, we'll put you in this car. And if you have no experience, we're going to give you um, a driver. So there's going to be an SCCA trained driver sitting in the, on the seat right next to you. So one thing we need is we always have room for new drivers. Of course we're looking for sponsors that would like to uh, connect with the veteran and active duty military community. And so there's a number of ways you can support the program. Number one, you can be a driver. Um, but we also have uh, a couple of other events you know, that are focused on bringing awareness to uh, veteran suicide issues um, outside of actually driving on the track. But if you're interested in connecting, just hit us on the website or you can um, email me personally at robert.rallyforvets.com and I will connect with you straight away.